I went to a couple last night. There were Why is it and every I got time? Oh my God. dumped below a few of them, but I'm not sure which ones I went cuz I was also not showing up the, at the one that I blah, blah, that was blah, blah, I was labeled blah, 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 to have go, blah, blah, gone to. Blah, blah. Are are you visiting oh, me God. via my uh wormhole? Yeah, I'm going to do a stargate, but I wanted to do an introduction. Every single time I try to record, somebody just talks as soon as I hit that record button. It's oh my God, you guys have impeccable timing. <laughs> Okay, so I'm gonna select your. Oh, I ate my pork. Damn it! Well, oh, I'm selecting. That's stupid. Okay. Teleporting now. Oh, I see you. Yeah, I'm just waiting. As I, I was actually about to go to spawn, and then he said that, and I'm like, oh, I'll wait. We're gonna tour Irish's place. Maybe spend the night okay. again. Try to. Bring back that first evening of pure joy. <laughs> Unnecessary portal, I see. Well, you know, if we're going into the nether having fun. All which right. I've so done with place. Kaz a couple times. Yeah, this is just my teleportation room. Down there is my uh, mining area and a farm and stuff like that. You got a cart down there? I got cart goes all the way down to the bottom and multiple boosters so you can go all the way down and up and this is my side entrance you spent given that I live on a Mesa it's uh, essential having an entrance at ground level where's your booster that is the booster yeah but there's no booster cart in here no that is the booster cart I see no you cart. can't see the cart that's right here oh okay you're just not able to see the cart that's weird there's a booster cart in there Okay. Oh yeah, by the way, so my idea for the store was that uh, we could, the admins could put a store, or the owners could basically put the signs wherever somebody builds a nether portal. That way you don't have to build it in just one spot. Okay, so where do I right click in order to get into a cart? Uh, come the over cart? here. Uh, I will give you a cart. I I don't use an automated system. Basically, stand here and just click on the top block of track, and the cart will sit above you. And then you right-click the cart, get into the cart. You gotta stand right at the top, though. <laughs> Crap. I oh, you're it. good. <laughs> okay. <laughs> it's weird. On my screen, you weren't in the cart at all. And I wasn't all of a in the cart. In the cart and you went yeah. past me. No, I wasn't in the cart, and I caught it all as it came back around. Yeah, the invisible I, booster like, cart. Awesome. <laughs> I can do stuff with redstone, but I find it's easier just to make an incline and and use that. So. Oh, and I then guess for going not down. So invisible booster. I didn't make it. Okay, I'm coming back down now. We. <laughs> no, cart, come back, I love you. <laughs> it's gone. <laughs> well, that's weird. The, uh, let, me, let me replace the booster cart. It should have made you go all the way. Yeah, but if it's an invisible booster cart, maybe it won't work. Well, I put it back, so... Okay, let's try this again. I feel Poor like Kaze. I'm getting boosted. Even though Kaze all the really wants to play TF2. Oh, there's just the one. Well, that's weird how you're not making it up. I think it's because the boosters are invisible. That's really strange. Or maybe muffins are just naturally more dense. <laughs> <laughs> that is very strange. The Irish are lightweights after all. Okay, let me try. I'm gonna log off and log back on. Yay, not so invisible booster carts. Yeah, I also uh, picked it up and put it down again. That also might help. Hey, 
have you heard, um, I, I've decided I'm gonna set up a cannon like 200 blocks away from the Dwarven Kingdom and I'm gonna start bombing them from <laughs> afar. Oh my god, do they know this? I, I told them I was gonna set up a cannon out of their view, um, but I don't think they took me seriously. <laughs> So this is just so, my storeroom. Semi-organized, cool. but not hugely organized. Just enough to be able to put everything around. And upstairs is the house. Oh, hello house. Oh, we just spent the day uh, or night together, Irish. I didn't even realize. Time just flies when you're having sex. I mean, fun. <laughs> this is my bedroom. You can come in here. Oh, Close the bedroom. Door. Oh, cool. I'm going to take one of these. Yoink. Okay. This uh, crafting table here is here just because of what you're actually standing on. This is a walkway because we're uh, on a mesa and the walkway, if you follow me down but follow me carefully. Made a bridge across to this island. It's a natural island. Oh. And actually, if you go over here and you look back, you can see my my uh, ground entrance with the lights and how the Mesa hangs. It's like an overhanging Mesa. That's very dark. Black, even. So I'm going to make this a little, kind of like a little picnic area, almost. I'm going to put cool. another little fire and a couple of little benches. You should make it a, oh, like and a floating Mario planet there. It'll be like Mario Galaxy. <laughs> oh, actually, if you stand here and look this way... You should be able to see a fence in the distance. Look out. Is yeah, your draw distance anything. far? Uh, yeah, it's pretty far. But I don't know what to look for when I don't know what to look for. Oh, okay, just a creeper out of walking the, over almost there. the limit of your draw distance, there's a fence. It's kind of hard to see, but... Hmm, no. Can't quite see it? Oh, okay, well, anyways, the my entire land out at just around where the edge of the draw distance is, there's a fence that goes all the way around. It doesn't go through the water yet, but... Oh, I think I see the fence now. Okay. It looks kind of like yeah. uh, railroad tracks there. Yeah. yeah. And I'm going to make little fenced-in entrance areas. Oh, and look at my bridge with uh, the shape of it. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, and I've got another one if you come Sun. to this side because... As far as the eye can see, this is your kingdom. Yes, exactly. And I did that because I want, this if Pride people Rock. come out here... I want them to build outside of my view distance, so, and then that <laughs> way my view always stays nice. Uh, that's cool. I got the mossy cobblestone for my foundation along the outside. You know what I did to keep people away from me? Traps? <laughs> Yellow no. running at them? <laughs> <laughs> I burned the trees on all the surrounding islands. Oh my god. <laughs> Come on over this way. I'm like, screw you people, nobody will want to be around here. So if you see like this cluster of islands that have no trees for like some odd reason, yeah, I was there. So there's my other bridge. And cool. this bridge over here was actually a natural stone and dirt bridge. Um, the mountain over there was separated from this mesa by just a single line of dirt and stone. So I turned it into a bridge. That's pretty cool. And I think it's um, on this side was actually where I was going to build. Um, where is it? Score, black sheep. Um, oh yeah, over here is where I was going to build. Out of my way, sheep. There's a, uh, a natural valley with the mountain that's across the way. And this and little your valley in here. Again. I was going to build in this natural valley, and I was all excited about it, but then I thought I'd check the area, and when I found the Mesa with the floating island, I was like, oh, that's just perfect. Are you uh, a geography enthusiast? No, I just wanted a, a neat place to live in. I wanted to have a nice view, and... I've got two weird... Uh, pyramid structures over here actually. It's kind of strange. Um, 
If you look out towards that lone tree towards the sand... Oh, where are you? Where did you go? Spy went cloak, man. Look behind you. I already have. <laughs> oh, okay, well, let me come closer behind you. Oh, there you are. Um, okay, if you stand here and look out, uh, not at the big tree to the left, but the small tree out there, just past the small tree, there's two little again. pyramid type things. I disappeared again. Yeah, I know. I noticed that. Peekaboo. Do you see me? I see you. I'm looking right at you. The hell are you doing? <laughs> That's pretty funny. It's like, where, where did he go? And like, he's gone again. Oh, did you leave the game and then rejoin? No, dude. I'm, oh. I've been standing right here the whole time. I just crouched That's and weird. moved away from you. Oh. <laughs> That's funny. See, now I'm gone. I have two. Oh, I have a bunch of pigs. In get out of the way. It's the only problem with this bridge. If you get some animals on it, it's a pain in the ass to walk over. But yeah, I've got these two weird little pyramid structures out there that were naturally generated. I don't know why. That's pretty cool. I'm gonna have to make the long trek home. Let's see. I have to head north, right? Oh. And if you ever need arrows, um, well, you could always use my gate to go home or go back to the spawn no, no, or something no, like no. that. No, no, no. I gotta do it natural. I took the gate to get okay. here, but then I'll, I'll look for home by myself. Okay. Well, come come this way then. I'll get you down There's to ground level, right? and then I'll come on down here. You should see my house. I have like facade after facade. Like fake walls and stuff? Or? Yeah, I'll show it to you uh, if you want to come by later. Yeah, sounds good. So come on out here for a second. Um, if you so leave and you arrows? go to the... R hmm? Arrows? Uh, yeah, no, if you, if you leave and you go to the right, um, you basically just go at a 45 degree angle from my place. And when you to get the to left. the water, when you get to the water, you go to the left, and there's a small structure with torches. I've got to put up some signs so that when people come by, they know where to go. But uh, come on inside. You have and a spawner here. This, yeah, this big structure here is a spider spawner. If you go all the way to the bottom. And you have to stand all the way over here. This is close enough for spiders to spawn. And it has two streams. It has a, an upper stream and a lower stream that come together. And all you get about 90 to 100% of the drops. Wow. Where's the skelly spawner? Hey, you're going to move out of the way. Yeah, i got to put signs. But uh, this right here... There's probably an easier way to build a skelly <laughs> uh, drowning thing. Uh, that well, no, that's the spider. That's the spider one, and spider ones are difficult to do. the The skeleton one is super easy. This is the skeleton one. Yeah. The spider ones, because they climb things, you have to have them get pushed down by water. But one water thing against a wall, like one water and then wall across the gap, the spiders will climb up against the water. But if you have two streams of water coming down, then it forces the spiders down into the killing uh, section. And in order to not have any dead space, you have to have the two separate waterfalls go down two separate ways. Otherwise, if both of the waterfalls both curve and go down one plane, you'll have dead space in the bottom corner, and something like 50% of the drops will all sit in that little dead space. Uh. Yeah, in order to get the highest possible percentage of drops from the spiders, you have to make two streams, and they have to have two levels that they go down. But yeah, so this is just a standard skeleton spawner. Works like a hot dam. That's cool. But yeah, so if you ever need arrows, feel free to come here anytime you like. Will do. I'll stop stealing from hungry. <laughs> Let 
does make our journey back. And I'm thinking of making a separate entrance into here, but I figured I might just leave it. It's not like it's difficult to get to. That's cool. Yeah, the spider one was a pain in the butt because I, I made it so that it went to a collection point that worked really, really well. But you totally but you didn't get and 100 you got two spawners right next to each other. Yeah, and I haven't even checked the rest of my area. Like, I'm going to be doing a lot of mining underneath, so eventually I'll find more of them. Okay. Point so you me, need to go me. north? Just north? What? Which way? Which, where's your place? <laughs> I, I just want to go back to spawn. Oh, uh, yeah. Just go north, because I'm south. Um... Wow, creepers already spawned. Wow. Yeah, you want to go north and east, so go to your right a little bit as well. Okay. Okay, gotta get inside. <laughs> Maybe I should just burn down all the trees here, and then I will be able to find my way easier. <laughs> no. My wonderful trees. I'm just kidding. I don't even have my flint with me. I'll remember it next time, though. About how long will it take for me to get back? Uh, about two days. Oh, two days. <laughs> Fair ways out. That's. I basically w ran around just looking for stuff until I got lost. And then once I realized I was completely lost and I had no clue where I was, that's when I started searching for my home. Oh, two days. Okay, I guess I'll have to end the recording here. Walk down that mountain, some road, all by yourself. Don't turn your head back over your shoulders. And don't be stopped to check yourself when the silver moon is shining high. Random sand in the middle of nowhere. I will stand on you. Boom, like a boss. Yeah.
Any mountains between your place and the spawn. Uh, there's all sorts of fun stuff. Um, if you want to check your progress of where you're at, just hit F. You know, to hit F3, right? And where's spawn though? Zero zero zero. Or not zero zero zero. Sorry, uh, zero zero four. X and Z. I am still so far away. You can teleport to me, I'm in spawn. No, it's okay. I gotta do this like a man. At what point does the negative numbers become zero? What? Never mind. The, you, you want them to get closer to zero. If they're getting farther from zero, you're going the wrong way. But I'm going north. Mm-hmm. From whose house? from Irish who's in the south. Irish, are you actually south? Well, I have a feeling you're going the wrong way or you maybe already passed spawn. God damn it. Yeah, you're aiming for zeros. I'm at yeah, like, I'm. I, I'm at like negative one thousand something. Yeah, he gave you really bad directions then, didn't he? You no, know, it just could be that I went right past it because um, he's further east than, or he's further whatever west than he originally thought he was, I guess. So then I just walked right past it and kept walking overnight. So yeah, the zero zero will take you just like within one block of spawn. I'm gonna have to end it here.